If you think world-ending scenarios are just for movies, brace yourself. This isn't a Hollywood script or a wild conspiracy theory. This is a real scientific thought experiment. Imagine every nuclear weapon on Earth detonating at the exact same time. It sounds impossible, but let's walk through what would actually happen, step by step. First, the numbers. There are about 13,000 nuclear warheads worldwide, maintained and ready to launch. If all exploded at once, the combined energy would be about 6,000 megatons of TNT, over 400,000 times the Hiroshima bomb. That's enough destructive force to wipe out civilization several times over. The immediate aftermath? Pure chaos. Cities would vanish in an instant, replaced by craters and radioactive ash. Overlapping blast zones would reduce entire regions to ruins. Mushroom clouds would rise into the sky, visible for thousands of kilometers, as shockwaves flattened everything in their path. The devastation wouldn't stop at city limits. Shockwaves would circle the globe, shattering windows on every continent. The heat would ignite massive fires, creating firestorms that consume forests, grasslands, and anything that burns. The air would be thick with smoke and radioactive dust, but the worst part isn't the explosions, it's what comes after. All that dust and radioactive debris would block out sunlight worldwide. This nuclear winter could drop temperatures by 10 to 20 degrees Celsius. Crops would fail, ecosystems would collapse and famine would spread. The skies would turn dark, and summer could feel like winter for years. Most of the world would become unlivable. Billions would be at risk of starvation, disease and exposure. Infrastructure would break down, and even the oceans would suffer as plankton die off, disrupting the food chain. Survivors would face a harsh frozen world, struggling to find food and shelter. There might be one place left, Antarctica. Its remote location and lack of major cities could spare it from the worst blasts and radiation. It wouldn't be a paradise, temperatures would drop even further and food would be scarce. But it might offer a slim chance for survival. Scientists there could become the last witnesses to a world forever changed. So, the next time someone asks, what if every nuke went off at once, you'll know, it's not just the end of civilization, it's a planet transformed by fire, darkness and ice, with only a faint glimmer of hope on the frozen edge of the world.